Hello and welcome to Maths with Jacob. This lesson will focus on the four basic operations. Four operations. In mathematics, the four most widely used operations are addition, subtraction, multiplication and division. Four types of numbers. The four popular types of numbers that are used frequently when doing calculations are the whole numbers or the counting numbers starting at 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and they continue. Decimals, these are examples of decimals. Fractions, they are examples of fractions. This one's a mixed number or a mixed fraction. And integers, integers are whole numbers including the negative numbers. So we have the negative numbers, the positive numbers and 0. They constitute the integers. While there are other types of numbers that will be encountered throughout the many years of schooling, the four listed on the previous slide will be used quite extensively. Multiplication tables. While calculators are quite prevalent in today's society, a thorough knowledge of the multiplication tables increases confidence and allows students to perform many basic skills quickly and efficiently. Examples using tables. For each of the following, use your knowledge of tables to find the answer. Number one, six times seven. Now if you know your tables efficiently, you know that the answer is 42. Six sevens are 42. Nine times six, nine sixes are 54. Three divided into 21. Now if you know your tables well, you know that three sevens are 21. So 3 divided into 21 goes 7 times. 8 times something equals 40. A thorough knowledge of tables tells you that 8 fives are 40. So the square equals 5. Tom bought 5 pens at a cost of $4 each. What was the total cost of the pens? Solution? Five pens at four dollars each equals five times four dollars, which gives you twenty dollars. Five fours are twenty. The teacher shared seventy-two marbles between nine students. How many marbles did each student receive? The solution? Nine divided into seventy-two goes eight times. Now the reason that eight is the answer is nine eights are seventy-two. There's your knowledge of tables. So each student received eight marbles. Now here's some very important information. It is important to know that multiplication and division are inverse operations. An example to demonstrate this fact is as follows. We know from our tables that six nines are 54. Nine divided into 54 goes six times. Nine sixes are 54. Six divided into 54 goes nine times. Six nines are 54. So this video has looked at some basic numbers that we use. We've looked at the four basic operations and we've seen how important it is to have a good knowledge of our times tables.